Hi everybody and welcome to my channel. In today's video you can see me uh, painting and colouring a piece for Art a la carte's July Gemstones Challenge and the gemstone for this month was uh, Ruby. Um, all the materials that I'm using in this piece will be listed in the description below so check that out if you want to know what I'm using to make this piece. Uh, for this piece I decided to draw a girl with a gold and ruby headdress and I absolutely loved the sketch that I did which unfortunately I didn't film um, but I feel it all went downhill from there really. Uh, I had a really long ugly phase with this piece and I kind of managed to save it with some coloured pencils at the end but I wasn't massively impressed with the outcome. But anyway, as you can see, I started off by um, watercolouring her face and immediately I had problems. I have no idea what I am doing wrong, but every time I try to do a flat wash, I get this hol horrible cauliflower effect and I don't know why. I've watched many a video where artists lay down a perfect flat wash. I try to copy them, but it just doesn't happen. And I've tried it with both wet on dry and wet on wet. Whatever I do, I still get this horrible blooming cauliflower flower effect. Um, yeah, and I don't like it. So literally from about five minutes into this piece, I was frustrated and I wanted to give up. Uh, I tried another layer of paint but it didn't really help, it just made the blotchiness worse and just made more lines that stood out and oh, I couldn't really get rid of. Um, however, I did decide that I was going to try and fight through the ugly phase and see if I could fix this with uh, coloured pencils later on. So I got out my polychromos and I do think it did make quite a lot of difference um, but I'm still not 100% happy with how this piece has turned out. I think I'm actually happiest with how the ruby itself turned out. I really liked um, the effect that I got that it really does look like it's three dimensional. Um, you'll see me drawing that in a few minutes. Uh, yeah, so I think this piece might actually make a good draw this again piece in a year or so when hopefully who knows, I might actually start winning in the battle of the watercolours by then. If I haven't given up on them completely, of course. Um, so yeah, I did realise as well that once I had um, coloured this in, that the nose looked really odd. Uh, so I then uh, spent a couple of days practising noses in my sketchbook, uh, trying to get better at those as well. I have got a lot of uh, areas for improvement at the moment uh, lots and lots of things that I can practice which uh, sometimes is a good thing and uh, sometimes it means I try to practice too many things at once and uh, have trouble focusing on just one area but I have actually just recently signed up to Skillshare so I ought to really sit and find some time to do some of the watercolour courses on there it's just um, life is a bit hectic at the moment the school year's just started and uh, if you didn't know I'm a teacher so I'm busy trying to plan lessons and deal with kids and parents and uh, also my mum is coming to stay this week for 10 days too. So there's not going to be an awful lot of free time uh, in the next couple of weeks for practicing um, watercolours and other kind of paintings. Um, I feel like I really should have done some painting this weekend but I've just been so exhausted. It's been the first week, first full week back at school with a full week of classes and uh, I just have not had any energy this weekend. I came home yesterday and with the full intention to uh, sit and uh, do some painting after work and promptly fell asleep on my bed instead. And yeah, I just haven't really felt much more energy today either. Um, so I can always live in hope that uh, it'll calm down in a couple of weeks and I might actually have a bit more energy to do stuff but uh, I'm pretty cer certain that I'm I might just be kidding myself but anyway sorry for going off on a bit of a tangent I should probably go and practice my watercolors some more instead of sitting here and talking and uh, oh, procrastinating more than likely I <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video uh, I'll leave it to some music now and uh, I hope you all have a wonderful week. Feel free to subscribe if you're new here and that you like what you see. Uh, I will say not everything turns out a disaster like this piece. Um, so I don't want to put you off. But I uh, do 
I don't just want to show the good stuff. I do want to show that, yeah, there's quite a lot of uh, mishaps and uh, things that go wrong when uh, trying to learn to do art. So, yeah. Have fun. I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.